everybody it is Ruben Lowen here in Cyprus Texas it's Monday so we I did um, okay so I did my podcast on Friday talking about budgeting and the the one the one thing I neglected to talk about was a little trick to figure out your budget if you've never had a budget you, you I mean most people, do not know what they're spending. They have no clue. They don't know. Um, they, they know the check comes in. They kind of know how much it is pretty much every month. Right? And they just go on their way and the their habits of how they're spending and where they're going, their, their, their route, their rut. That's what they do. They're in their rut. Okay, and they go to these certain restaurants or fast food places, certain nights on the way home from church, whatever, right? And they they get gas at the same place, you know. Um, they go to Sam's Club or to because it's a little bit cheaper than everywhere else, even though they have to wait in line. You know, this these are. They have their 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 habits, and whatever's left over at the end of the month is what they have. Okay, they just aren't paying attention to it. Okay, but there's some magic that happens when you pay attention to it. Okay, we talked about that last on the podcast. Okay, well, if you don't have a budget, you don't know where your money's going. Okay then just for one month write it down every day and don't curb your spending because now you're keeping track of it just just keep track of what you're spending when you spend it okay and then at the end of the month now you can look at it you can put things into categories you can see exactly how much money you you spent eating out you can see how much you're spending in gas and why it's costing you so much? You know why you're why you're using so much gas? All right. Oh, okay. And and that will really open the door. Okay. To and it'll be an easy fix. You'll start seeing those areas that are like, you know, where all the bleeding's coming from. Speak it out loud. Okay, and your ears hear it. Okay, your subconscious, which is super powerful, has to subordinate to your conscious desires. It's like magic. It's like magic. That's that's what repentance does. Anybody who's in the church, listen to this. When you when you're in when you repent your sins, really do it. Yeah, those sins shut right down. They shut right down. You're actually, you'll have a fight in your mind when you try to go against those uh, commands that you made to yourself. You, you'll have a little, you'll, you will get it together. Okay. So when you write things, well, when you, when you go and you do your budget and you see those areas that are messing with you, you'll. You'll, you'll incorporate. So here's what I did. I actually, I was looking for just a notebook to write my budget down, write my spending down. Um, we had a, some guys doing this, so I'm going to do it with them. Haven't done it for a while, right? And I was going to just look for another notebook to keep track, right? Well, I found these, this 2024-2025 binder at Walmart for under $4. And so it's got, um, you know, they got the break down every day you know little notes you can make yourself but then it expounds to give you these these lines for the week right the, the daily um, tasks for the week and you can write them in there right and then it's got a note pa a whole bunch of note pages in the back where you can write notes or this is these, these are the pages that you can do um, write down 
your spending. Okay, how much you're spending in it. So here's the here's the note pages, right? So this so then this um, Friday we are going to talk about keep you know tracking your time. Okay, where you're wasting time. Okay, those non-productive, getting rid of that non-productive activities. Okay, you know, uh, and you, it'll it'll show you where you can go to increase those money-making activities, right? Um, you know what what you can do, whether it's making phone calls, um, going to meet with, you know, or going to events where there there are just all kinds of people that are in your target market. All right, it's a it's a really good, um, you know, it's gonna be a good podcast on Friday. All right, all right, have a great Monday.